All right, so all the time you spent together, whenever you have these kind of things, inevitably there are some, some funny memories that occur. Give us a couple examples. I had one. We were, we were running close to, so we started Cahoon Park. We were up on Lorraine Road, near Lorraine Road and Clay. So we had gone seven or eight miles up Dover to get to that point. And we usually had 20 or 25 guys strung out, right? And we were running on this one side street and it had a little bit of a curve. We were on two abreast, you know, kind of 10, 10 long. And a car comes at us, going fairly fast, and it swerves towards us intentionally, clearly across the lane. And then it swerved out of the way. And my, my teammate here uh, reaches out a hand and bangs the fender as it goes oh, by. It was a flat hand. <laughs> <laughs> flat. Loud enough to... It, Ma it makes that. more noise that <laughs> No, it was probably smart. Uh, and uh, we didn't think much of it. So, so we're about Lorraine Road. We head Clegg back into Bay Village. We get to Clegg Park, and all of a sudden, this car comes down the overpass hill on Clegg. A baseball bat sticking out of it. Another guy's got his arm out with a big Bowie knife on it. And uh, pulls in into Clegg Park and cuts us off. Two guys jump out, one with a baseball bat, one with a 12-inch knife, right? The funny thing is, there are 20 guys surrounding him, right? We were too chicken, because this guy's got a knife and a baseball bat, right? And he's wagging it in front of, who, who think I'll bang my car? This was a half an hour after, right? we saw the kid on Rain Road. He chased us all the way down, found us on Clay. Ultimately, the guy from Kane Gas Station came over. Well, said he called the police or something and, and said, hey, you guys get out of here, rescue us. But the funny thing for me, it was, it was, it was 20 to two, we were runners. We could have ran away. Yeah, I was thinking Such that. Such nice guys. Like, okay, settle down. We uh, we waited for the guy to come and rescue us. It was oh, that's funny. Right. Well, it was Mike Shinsky who was doing the most of the talking. He's captain. That's his job. I thought was we were going to lead the slowest guy there and I'll take off. Yeah. <laughs> we never did that. We stuck together as a team. That's funny, Chris. <clears throat> um, probably uh, when we switched over to uh, the my, my junior year, or was that our senior year? Senior. Okay, we uh, we went out and uh, we were at a two mile course and we never crossed over into the woods, which would be west of uh, the soccer fields. So we had to make more room to create a two a two and a half mile course. So we decided to go into the woods, and uh, we went with tools, and we cut our own paths into the woods. And uh, Huntington Woods, Huntington, Huntington Park. Yeah. Well. Yeah. And uh, we went in there, and the funny thing is, I think our payback from up above, uh, probably about, uh, I would say most of us uh, got poison ivy because we were <laughs> chopping through there. We got it all over. So you guys are on Metro Park property to decide, and you're going to cut your own paths <laughs> yeah. with your own tools. No permission, of no, course, no right? No permission. Yeah, so you end, <laughs> ended up with poison ivy. Yeah. And, and the trails are still there. Yeah, Yeah, yes. that's funny. Yeah. That's funny that you, you uh, cut those. All right, Rich, you got one to add? Yeah, um, I, it wasn't funny at the time, but it was, it was the winter, the blizzard of 76, 77, so it was after the season, and, and I'm doing, in my neighborhood, doing some running, and this car just squeals around me. <laughs> so no, I didn't really see, some guy jumped out of the car and started running after me. Normally I'm fairly slow, and most people can out sprint me the first 100 yards but this guy kept gaining on me and I'm like a quarter mile and he's still gaining on me. It was dark. Was it was dark yeah. and so it was like and I wasn't he was gaining on me too fast for me to look behind one of the rules of running right and finally Doug Fanta calls out Rich Rich you can slow down it's me. <laughs> if he hadn't done that I was like. Uh, Doug's a pretty big guy <laughs> anyway. Did you, know, you know, set that up? No. But oh, it, that sounds like something I, you would have done. You know, it, <laughs> right. That's what was threw me off because it, it was, I'm pretty sure it was Chris, but it wasn't his normal car. <laughs> it was probably Chris and Greg Hayes. You're right, Jeff. Yeah, I'm or sure. Or Chris Lowry. We'll have to go Lowry. Greg Hayes, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. 